So just before we, just before we start this video, I want to make a quick side note. Uh, I have to go tomorrow morning to Florida uh, to a, a sort of event, and I needed white pants. And uh, I have to go in about nine hours to the airport. And as I'm filming this, I get this little text. Can you uh, can you zoom in? There? I bought those pants, by the way. Did not steal those pants. I feel like well, I feel like it's going to be a bit risky to walk into a store and ask someone to take that off from me. So I'm kind of stuck. Maybe I'll just wear that to the party. I'll be the talk of the event. I don't know if it'll be for the right reason though. So anyways, let's get to the real point of this video. There's a new entrepreneur in town. Move over Elon Musk, all right? There's a new seat at the head of the uh, Silicon Valley table and it belongs to one soldier boy. I'm not kidding. So soldier boy, he's, he's dipping his toes into tech. Who would have known? Uh, and he's starting out by <laughs> entering the games console industry. You heard me right. Soldier Boy is releasing a gaming console with 800 games on it. How many games does your uh, console come with, Shigeru? You don't even put Mario Brothers on that. Soldier Boy's got 800 on his, and probably half of them are yours. So, anyways, Soldier Boy, uh, you may remember him from the Soldier Boy dance video, or uh, alternatively from such famously profound Twitter quotes as, In this world, you either crank that Soldier Boy, or it cranks you. To the first person that purchased my console, you just brought tears to my eyes. Tears of joy. What a, what is this? Am I reading a Stephen King novel or a Soldier Boy tweet? That was a hell of a twist. Thank you so much for your support. I promise to continue my tech company and evolve it in the gaming world. I'm just a kid with a dream. Aww. He's just a boy with a dream. I mean, granted it's a big dream, Pretty damn big dream, kind of dream maybe you want to be getting only if you majored in tech or business or finance, but he's just a boy with a dream. Cut him some slack. The way he's playing it is that this is actually his own product, but you will find that it is in fact just something you can buy on Amazon for half the price. And I should mention, by the way, that it's already half the price on his website on launch day. That's how you know you're getting a good product. I could sell you this for its retail price right away. But for you, anything. Slash that, half the price. This new NVIDIA RTX 2070, that's literally worth $700. Slash that price just for you. I mean, who does he think he's fooling? Like, I I've seen celebrity scams before, but holy crap. This is the point where like, does the FBI get involved? This is very illegal. I mean, this one here, it just shows Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Get ready to duke it out on Soldier Boy's new revolutionary device. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate is now available for purchase on the Soldier Game handheld gaming console. He fucking retweeted that. Is he joking? Is he serious? It's the best. It's the best troll ever, right? It's just the best troll of all time. A troll's so good it takes your money. Well, if this is all you got to do to join an industry these days. I'll tell you what, I'll be the biggest entrepreneur there is. I make fridges. I make fire extinguishers. I make thermostats. I make Christmas. Oh, shoot. I make cats. I make salsa. I made the Danish. I made the Danish. You could say that it was a joke or something, but I, I purchased it. I purchased it right here on SoldierWatch.com. I bought the Soldier Game and the Soldier Game handheld. Listen, we can razz the whole thing all we want. We can take Soldier Boy to a class action lawsuit but you can't sneeze at the features you're getting, all right? You can build in 3,000 plus games. You can even download support. I don't know what you do once you download it, but you can download it. Built-in chip, maybe. All right, this chip does not come loose in the packaging. <laughs> That's soldered right in. Soldier Boy did it for you himself. He's just that kind of guy. All right, for you, anything. You got direct chain on key. You got, your hand, you got your hand rope hole. It supports connerting to TV. Listen guys, I know you don't get it, but when you're trying to get into the tech world, you gotta break a couple eggs to make an omelet, all right? You got a guy like Steve Jobs up there. He gets on stage, he says, it's an iPod, it's a phone, and it's an internet browser. And then it clicks. Oh, I never thought to combine those things. Just like I never thought to combine an audio jack into RCA cables, at least I think. In fact, it may just be an RCA jack that uh, disappears into nowhere, sort of like uh, my money disappeared into Soldier Boy's wallet forever. Guys, we're talking RM support. We're talking RMVB. We're talking MKV, etc. By the way, just uh, curious, what about a MP4, MOV? Hell, I'll, I'll take a JPEG, Soldier, my boy. Guys, come on. 
Get real. Does your Xbox One run at game speed one-to-one -one output? <laughs> Didn't think so. I did. I bought. I bought. I bought the handheld. It's the Soldier Game handheld. Why didn't he just call it the Soldier Boy? I mean, for God's sake, he's already selling a Chinese console you can buy on Amazon, and you didn't even fucking call it the Soldier Boy. <laughs> this is what. This is what you're getting. All right. You picking up what I'm putting down? Let me show you what's on there. So I, I can't show you these. I'm, I'm a little too nervous uh, to break the law. Unlike Soldier Boy. But yes, it, it is just a console with a bunch of ROMs on it. And yes, it does run at exactly half the horsepower of a Super Nintendo. And, and this isn't actually the one Soldier Boy sent me. It's just one I got off Amazon.com. But the pictures are exactly the same. So I'm fairly certain it's the same thing. Can you believe it? He didn't even swap the pictures. He just, he literally is selling some Chinese bootleg console and he didn't even change the pictures. Is he insane? Well, you know what? I'll, I'll let you know if his version's any different, if it ever shows up, but uh, somehow I doubt it will because uh, as of today, uh, before my consoles have even shipped, he's actually updated his stock and added two more consoles. The Soldier Game Fuse on sale for a clean 399 USD. Uh, that one's a guaranteed uh, 54 frames a second on Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Make sure to look out for that one. And the Soldier Boy Mini on sale for 69.99. Well, would you look at that? The man listened to popular demand. He didn't, uh, he didn't pull down any of his illegal stuff, but he added more and uh, named one the Soldier Boy. Didn't just edit the name in the old one. Move over, Bill Gates. Move over, Jeff Bezos. Move over, Tim Cook. You guys are out of business, okay? What, does it take you, like, one year minimum to crank out a new device? Soldier Boy, two a day. Can your Kindle Fire play Neo Geo at three frames a second with intermittent crashes? Didn't think so, idiot. I got the console, too, by the way, just in case you're curious. It's basically the same thing, except it, I'm pretty sure I think it runs even slower. So, by the way, it's been about, like, two weeks or so since he released this, and... It's finally happened. Soldier Boy has reportedly been contacted by Nintendo, who is threatening to press criminal charges against the rapper. In the letter that was sent to Soldier Boy, Nintendo's team suggested that selling the game may violate the Trademark Counterfeiting Act, and that if it can be proved that he violated the law, Soldier Boy may be subject to substantial prison time. How'd you end up in this shithole? Serial murder? And you? Sold Soldier Game Handheld Boy? Online for $89.99 on sale. I guess I'll just accept that Christmas is ruined. My little boy will never get his soldier game. And I'll never get my $279.85 USD back. No. It couldn't be. It's amazing. John Tron will tell ya. Don't go ordering from SoldierWatch.com because honestly you can get that for like half the price on Amazon. Not that you should, because I'm pretty sure what he's selling is legal. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not trying to implicate you. Watch me play or watch me do, depending on if they have to deliver it. Playing ROMs, but honestly, I thought it'd be Soldier Boy's game. Why did not call the Soldier Boy? Million people's dreams destroyed. Literally can't believe they possibly overlooked that. Game Gear, Game Boy, NES. Gotta say, I'm not impressed. Pretty sure my calculator can play Mario less lucky than this. One to one, I'll put my foot. Possibly facing real jail time. It's not liable, I'm just saying Nintendo has sued for less. Okay, man, good luck with that. I don't know, I wouldn't have done it, but you, I mean, you're just a boy with a dream, and I get that. I've been a boy with a dream. I just did it through legal channels. All right, man, <laughs> see you later. God bless. Soldier, Soldier Boy for life. life. By the way, do you not want Soldier Boy stealing your credit card details to fund his new set of grills? If so, ExpressVPN is the service for you! Without a VPN, your internet browsing data can be tracked by your ISP, cellular provider, ad companies, and hackers. When you use a VPN, your public IP address is masked, so even the websites you visit won't be able to identify you. VPNs also encrypt your internet data, preventing others from sniffing your information over the network. ExpressVPN is great for me because, like anyone, I like to feel safe while I'm browsing online. It's just that little bit of extra security that makes me feel secure. ExpressVPN is fast, easy to use, and rated the number one VPN service by TechRadar. Take back your internet privacy today and find out how you can get three months free by clicking the link in my description box, expressvpn.com slash JonTron.
And that is EXPRESSVPN.com slash JonTron for three months free with a one-year package. Take back your privacy today with less than $7 a month and a 30-day money-back guarantee. All right, everyone. Until next time, I'm off. Thank <laughs> you.